What is polytheism? The term polytheism comes from the two Greek words, poly, which means many, and theos, which means God. Hence, etymologically speaking, polytheism is the belief in many gods. It is important to note that polytheism characterizes virtually all religions other than Judaism, Christianity, and Islam, which share a common tradition of monotheism, the belief in one God. For a discussion on what is monotheism, please refer to the link in the description below. Now, it is also important to note that polytheism is based upon the idea that the universe is governed by more than one force. Therefore, there may be a water god, a mountain god, a desert god, and the like. And each of these gods must be appeased. This explains why these different forces receive some type of worship. The term polytheism is sometimes applied to a wide variety of religious traditions with a range of divergent theological stances. A deeper investigation into the nature of belief is needed if we are to avoid misunderstandings. In particular, some beliefs that acknowledge the existence of many gods nevertheless tend in the direction of monotheism when considering the nature of ultimate reality. These include henotheism, that is, the acknowledgement of one supreme god among a pantheon. Monotry, that is, the worship of one particular god while acknowledging the existence of others. And even emanational mystical monotheism, that is, the interpretation of many deities as being different names for a single god. Polytheism has been denigrated by monotheists. For example, Jews and Christians believed the gods of Greece and Rome to be fallen angels and the source of Roman cruelty and oppression. Stories of the loves and hates of the gods have been alleged to promote a culture of moral laxity. Philosophers of religion who view religion's development as an evolutionary process have regarded it as an inferior stage. On the other hand, certain modern scholars prefer polytheism over monotheism for its greater tolerance of diversity.